For 3a, they want us to convert degrees, minutes, seconds into just all decimal degrees. First, what we want to do is think of this as 61 degrees plus uh, 42 minutes plus 21 seconds. So we want to separate it. Now each of these we have to convert over into degrees. So we have to know what the conversion factor is for this. Now we don't have to do anything with the 61 degrees. It's already in decimal degrees. What we're going to do next is change out the minutes and the seconds. So for the minutes we have 42 minutes and we want to multiply it by the conversion. So the conversion is for this that uh, one degree is equal to uh, 60 minutes is how that works. So looking at that you would have one degree here and you're going to put the minutes down below. You want these minutes to cancel and you want it left in terms of degrees. So we want to put, that's why we put 60 on the bottom. We want it to cancel with the, the minutes there. Now next we have 21 seconds so the conversion for this is one degree is the same thing as 3600 seconds. So that would allow you to cancel that one out. We're going to now just do the calculation and it says round to two decimal places. 61 degrees plus, so we're going to do 42 divided by 60. And when you do that you just get 0.7 degrees, that's only one decimal place that that, that ends in. Next, we're going to do 21 divided by 3600. Now this one is 0 .00583 with some more decimals that comes after it if you take 21 divided by 3600. So we get these three. Now this would be in terms of degrees as well. Now you're going to add all this together and you want to round it to two decimal places. Okay, so what we get is we get 61 and then that's going to give us 61.71 degrees when we put this together. You get 0.07 and then with the 5 afterwards that rounds it up to 1 if you round it to two decimal places. So degrees, minutes, seconds, it would be the equivalent of 61.71 degrees.